Hello everyone, welcome to Simi channel. In this video, I will show you how to install Timor Loader version 2024.2.3.0. Uh, first thing first, you need to connect your laptop or PC to internet. And also, don't forget to run Steam. If you didn't have, you must to download it first because to download some mods, you need to have Steam. Next, you need to have all of this file. First is a Terraria and Timor Loader the game .rar, and second is Timor Loader 2024.2.3.0.zip. Now you must to extract Terraria and Timor Loader the game .rar using a 7-zip or WinRAR. After that, open the folder until you see two files. First is Timor Loader and the second is Terraria setup. Now we need to run Terraria setup. Uh, checklist yes i have read and accept eula and then click options make sure you are the checklist terraria and create desktop icon and and install game 2 uh, for example i want to put terraria game in partition system i mean c and inside folder games so in the setup click browse and go to partition system and go to folder games click ok now do not change the last folder just make it a terraria and click install first the installation will be fast until the 75 percent it will you can see uh, it's like stop but it still run in the background so you must uh you don't need to worry you don't need to be panic just give it more time because it will be done in 20 or 15 minutes As you can see now the installation is run again and it's done the installation has finished and you can just click exit all right now you can see in partition system and inside folder games there is a terraria folder and terraria application like this and now we go to timor loader and copy timor loader folder and put in here next to the terraria not inside terraria folder that's it i hope you can follow it carefully because if you making some mistake uh timot loader will not be able to run now open timot loader folder and then you will find start timot loader dot bat double click and it will show like this launch utils now you need to wait five minutes until the installation done and now you can see the installation is done and the timor loader will start if you if the installation did uh, if the timor loader didn't start and show something's error like this then you need to watch my new video all right everyone now we are in my menu Timot Loader, but it's still old version. The version is 2024.1.3.0. What we want is a version 2024.2.3.0. So we need to update Timot Loader. And also you can see in the mods, there is a lot more require a newest version. And that's why we need to update this version. To do that, we just need to click exit and go to Timot Loader 2024. 
2.3.0.zip Extract it using WinRAR or 7-zip And then open And copy all the files And go to Tmod Loader And paste Replace the files And it's done Now just click start tmodloader.bat again and you will see the version will change to the newest version all right everyone now you can see in my menu tmod loader the version has changed to 2024.2.3.0 and if you go to workshop and download mods there is a lot of mods and they didn't need or require new version again next i will show you how to install some mods for example i want to install calamity and click download with dependencies it will show like this sometimes the download will show a progress bar and it will not show so you don't need to panic just wait until the download is done but in this time it show the download progress this one is one of the big mod I ever use the other mod is like stars and Thorium, but I prefer with Calamity because it's at a lot of new boss. All right, it's done. Now go back and go to manage mods. Now you need to uh, enable. Calamity mod and Calamity overhaul just for example if you done just click back and it will uh, load the mod automatic Alright, now the Lord Calamity mod is done. It should be if the Calamity mod work, you can change the background to Calamity like this. Alright guys, now you can see I in the game world and there is a new item from Calamity mods. This is show the Calamity work well and also with the mod loader. So I think that's it from my video. Everything is going well without any problem, but if you reach a problem or have something you didn't understand, you can comment on my video or join my server. I will help you as I can. And also, don't forget to support me with likes and subscribe. I hope my channel can reach 100 subscribers. So I think that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to watch my new video. And I think that's it. Thank you. See you in the next video. Goodbye. Bye-bye.